Hi, I'm Nancy. Welcome to my kitchen. So let's get started. Today I'm going to show you how to cook pan-seared salmon. And this is a, a subscriber request. And this only requires two ingredients. I have a salmon fillet and kosher salt. And this really not much prep. For the salmon, take it out of the fridge at least 15 minutes before you're ready to cook it. And this will allow the fish to come up to room temperature. And that's really important because if you put a cold piece of fish on a hot pan, the fish will immediately seize up and that's going to cause a, an even cooking. And the next thing you need to do is make sure to dry the salmon up. I have a paper towel here. And just pat dry it. And by drying out the fillet, this is going to help prevent the fish from sticking to the pan. Okay, I'm going to wash up a little bit. And next, we're just going to season it with the salt. And I like using kosher salt because I can see where the crystals are going. Let's take up the sides. Okay, and that's it. And this is all the prep we need to do. So uh, let's start cooking. Okay, I have a cast iron pan set at a medium high heat. And let this heat up for a couple minutes. We'll add a little bit of oil. And swirl it around a bit. And you know the oil is hot enough when you see a rippling. So let's put the salmon fillet skin side down. And the majority of cook time is going to be on the skin side down side. So now we want to cook the salmon undisturbed. And that's the most important part. Don't touch it. Don't try to move it around. Just let it cook on its own. And you can see that the salmon is starting to turn color. And you can see that the salmon is cooking from the bottom up. So now we're going to let this cook until it cooks up about halfway through the fillet. And you can see the color is changing. It's going to get smoky. And your cooking time is going to vary depending on how thick the fillet is. So it can be anywhere between 6 to 9 minutes. And you can see that the fillet has cooked up to about 3 quarters of the way. So now we can flip it. So I have a fish spatula. Flip the fish away from you. Just cook on the other side for about two minutes. And I also like to cover it and this creates an oven effect. Okay, after two minutes, just uncover the fillet and we'll let this sear for another 30 seconds uncovered. Okay, so turn off the heat, remove it from the pan. Now let the salmon rest for three to five minutes and you have the perfect medium cooked fish. As you can see, I like the fish to have a little bit of char. The crunchy exterior is going to be a nice contrast to the tenderness of the fish. And I like to just serve it with some lemon wedges. And I also like to serve the salmon with seasoned nori strips. And I buy the whole sheets and I just cut them in half. This is actually a better value than buying the individual packets. And what I'm using is a large pack of olive toasted seaweed. And you can get this at the Asian market. Well, let's uh, cut into it and you can see the, the fish. You 
can see that it's moist on the inside. And it's cooked to a perfect medium. And here's how I like to eat it. You just grab a piece of the nori, add a little bit of the rice, and just take small pieces. Add the salmon, and just squeeze it with a little lemon. And that's it. Pop this whole thing in your mouth, and it's absolutely delicious. This is the simplest way to eat salmon. Enjoy! Okay, let's see if Shadow likes it. Oh, yummy. She loves salmon. Thank you for watching, everyone. Until next time, eat well and be healthy. Good girl.